Okay, so let's make it so that our projectiles can move now in the direction that they are launched in. Let's open up that script. And we're going to want to put a launch function inside of here so that when our projectiles instanced, another script can tell it what direction it's going to move in. So I'm going to put in function launch and we're going to pass in a direction. So P underscore direction vector two. So var direction, it's going to be vector two. And we're going to set that up right here in launch. So direction equals P direction. Okay, and then we need the projectile to actually move. So let's say function underscore process or physics process actually is probably a little bit more appropriate. Let's do that. At export var speed up here at the top of type float. I'll set it to 100. So that'll just be the default speed for the projectile. So we want to say translate here. Any node 2D can translate across the screen, it's movement without any collision. And we're going to say that we're moving in the direction times the speed times the delta. So let's jump into the weapon 2D script where we're adding the child of the projectiles parent. So now we want to call projectile.launch in the P direction that we pass into the cast function so that it'll actually set it to something proper. Now uh, we can see that down here on vector timeout, we're using vector 2.right. Okay, now let's hit play. And we have our projectile shooting to the right 